We need to run down here, claim it, and then get it in a cryopod. It's getting attacked by a car now. Can I pick up the baby? No, I can't. Okay, option B. I know my melee is the strongest right now. I almost have 200% plus. Okay. Okay, baby mammoth. You. Okay. I need you in the cryopod now. Hey guys and gals, Gunshy More back with another episode here of Ark Survival Ascended here on the island where today we're going to be continue on taming up those creatures that I need that are very essential for me to continue progressing in the game. Now there is other stuff that I am realizing I also will need besides the creatures, but as of now what we're going to be working on is the creatures. So to get started here, originally I thought I was going to have to get another 10 levels for the Argentavis because apparently you get their saddle here at level 62, which is kind of uh, ridiculous. I thought it was like level 45. It might be level 45 back in ASC. It might be level 62. I can't really remember, but I could have sworn it was lower than 62 at some point. But yeah, we are, we're apparently not high enough level to fly the Argentavis. So what we're going to be doing instead, I don't know why I closed this, is we are going to be going and crafting up cryopods. Which, for some reason, I'm high enough, high enough level to create cryopods, but not a high enough level to fly an Argentavis. J just pointing that out. Now, to start out with the cryopods, there is one little resource I have to run and get. And get. I have everything else. I need to go get obsidian. Okay, so we're almost here to the top of the volcano. Just went here because this is the easiest place to get obsidian. For, like, my knowledge to find it. So, we're just going to get enough to carry here back. I don't want to over-encumber myself or the... Pteranodon, especially the Pteranodon, so I just got to get enough where he can still move fast enough, you know? So, let's get that. And there we go. I got me 111 obsidian here. I think that's enough for now. I do realize I could technically fit more on my Pteranodon, but I'm actually just not going to bother. Because technically it would be more efficient for me to go out and club penguins to get organic polymer. Because that stacks up pretty high. Even though it spoils, I could still get a lot more of it than what I will get out of combining cementing paste and the obsidian. So, Alrighty now, last second to last thing that we got to do here to get the cryopods here is actually get the polymer made up. And I just realized a very, very big leap in judgment I made. Um, I don't even have a fabricator. Never mind, guys. I do got a fabricator. I just quickly went and <laughs> grabbed everything and brought it over. And grabbed some of my cementing paste. Hopefully here we still have enough for the amount of polymer we need. I don't think we need that much for actually making the polymer. I think it's just like one. It's a, like a one-to-one -one combination of... Uh, Cementing paste to obsidian, or it might be a two to two. We'll see here in a second. Let me quickly pull it up though. Yep, it's two cementing paste for two obsidian. I think we get one polymer. Now, all I got right now is 28 cementing paste, and all I made here in the forge there was five gasoline. So let's turn this on, and we can make 14. That's actually perfect because all I want is 12. So I'm gonna make three cryopods here. So it takes four polymer each, so 12 is just enough. So we could have made the 14, but I'd rather conserve some of the resources. Now as well, I'm not going to leave my fabricator running because it's just noisy. But actually, technically, now that I remembered it, I actually have a cosmetic for that. Unfortunately, I can't really see them because I don't understand the new layout of cosmetic. Oh, here it is. So if I take this and... I apply it to one of my skins. Do I not have a structure skin I can apply this to? Really? I don't have one of those? See, I don't understand how the cosmetics work anymore. They changed them up on me. Because, like, can I not just, like, equip this and go four and... Did that work? 
Yes, it did. Okay, now now I understand it. Maybe I'm not as maybe it's not as complicated as I thought. Alrighty, so I got all the resources now I need for the cryopods gathered up. All we have to do now is run over here to Red Ob to craft them. You guys want to know something? This is the inventory of the stuff I had back on Aberration. Um, like these are the structural bits. Like I like when I originally built was building my base. This is where I was storing my structures. And I forgot to take some of them out. Um What do I do with that? I'm gonna just leave them in there. Alright, and we're gonna we're gonna forget about them for now, okay? We're just gonna pretend like they never I never saw those. So let me transfer over all the stuff here for the cryopods. I got a feeling this stuff was going into the inventory. Yep. So we actually gotta drag this over and in. I, yeah, sometimes that bugs out. You gotta love the bugs that pop up. But here we go. We're gonna craft up these three cryopods. Alrighty, so now that we got these three cryopods, we are gonna go out and try to tame up all three of the creatures I need. Um, so first off here, we're actually gonna go for an Anki. Now, I need to turn my caps locks off, but now we've already attempted this once, and I think... Yes, we got one. I am willing to go tame actually out here. This is level 75. Let me double check it. Do I really want this? Its weight is at fit or is it? Yeah, its weight's at 12. Its damage is at 13. Those are kind of the stats I'm looking for on Ankies. Stop tracking. Oh, those are all my actual tames as of right now. Um, Is there any high, high levels? I don't see one any like standing out. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna crank this up. I know I really shouldn't. So the minimum is gonna be 75 because that's the decent level that I found. Anything higher? Yes. Oh. Okay. No. That's a definite. But that is a long journey just to go tame a creature. But you know what? It's gonna be worth it. Especially because, yeah, no, this one actually has the best stats for us right now. It's got bait, like, all its high stats are, sadly, one of them is in food. But the other two are at least in weight and food, which are the decent ones for Ankies. Now, if that other one would have at least been in, like, stamina or health, this would have been a perfect Anki, you know? But this one will work for what we need. Okay, so we have made it over to that 130 Anki. We got just one itty bitty teensy problem though. It's by the Arctic. So I do got somewhat of a half-baked plan. And that is to aggro the Anki here real quick by biting its tail. Come on, buddy. Even though I know one swipe from this Anki will probably mess up my Pterandodon pretty good. We're going to just stick close to the ground. Let him get kind of close and just slowly inch forward until he's at least off this cliff. Okay? That's my plan as of right now. So as long... Ooh, this might be a bad plan. Ah, uh, yeah, we're leading him right to Deodons. How bad would it be right here? It'd actually probably be pretty decent right here now that I think about it. So, what I'm going to do to actually trap this dude is pretty, pretty stupid so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna do a dat and then we're gonna do that and i messed it up already so we're trying to pin him in this i know i don't have to but you know what? i'm not even gonna bother i'm just gonna use that for later when i need to protect him from the creatures that are about so i'll use the cage there to enclose him for safety so let's just get started I missed that arrow. I don't like that. We're just going to get started here and pelting him in the face. Not real liking where we are right now. One of those mammoths that was fighting the Deodons. I think it's losing. Or one of them died. But this guy's also taking forever to pass out. He's just non-stop wanting to come after me. 
I think he's starting to. Are you going to pass out on me soon? No, no, AI, do not run this way. Go the other way, please. That's why I'm trying to stand in front of you. Like, I don't know why, but he keeps trying to run over here into that murder pile. And, of course, I get you to pass out right here. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's unequip this and not shoot you as I put that down. That was a close one. I was honestly about to shoot him. Okay. Now... Last one here. We'll use it to cover your tail. So... A little bit of an enclosure box for protection. I know I could do better, but... It's all I have for now. Did you guys finish that fight with the Daodon? Yeah, and you guys don't look too good. Damn. Use beat up. Oh, use a level 100. And you have a child. Ooh. Okay. Opportunity have may have struck us. Um. So one of the creatures I need to get is technically a wood gatherer. And mammoths or like the S plus like tier of wood gatherers on the island. Now I could get a beaver that is just like the A plus variant, but like getting the mammoth that again, that's like the better, that's the best like wood variant. Like, and I know I could, I could, it's injured. I could do it. I could do it. But the question is, do I really want to risk it? Especially with that mammoth there and I do. I do want to risk it. I do want to risk it for the biscuit. I just got to be very careful here. Keep targeting that mammoth. It's going to get up there, get that one's mate boost, and then that one's going to drag over. Dang it. This is bad. This might be very bad. Yep, see, it just got its mate boost and is dragging over. This is, this is worst case scenario here. If I could get the mother killed, then leave... I shouldn't be doing this. It's running, though, is the thing. It's running. Okay. That's not good. That's a third mammoth. They are multi- I killed it. I killed it. I killed it. I just saw it. Okay. 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 Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. You guys are still coming at me. Let me get in the air. And then we got to do something here. Mammoth. We want this level 100 baby that's nearby. We need to run down here, claim it, and then get it in a cryopod. It's getting attacked by a car now. Can I pick up the baby? No, I can't. Okay, option B. I know my melee is the strongest right now. I almost have 200% plus. Okay. Okay, baby mammoth. You, okay, I need you in the cryopod now. We'll worry about you here in a minute. Oh, it's going to prevent me from cloning. This stupid, stupid Carno had to attack my baby. But you know what? That's actually two creatures. As of right now, I can say that we can check off the list. Because, oh, I can't quite say the, you know. I won't quite say the Anki, but that's two creatures, and one of them, hopefully, we do not lose because it is a baby. Okay, baby mammoth is cryoed up. Um, let's go check in on our Ankylosaurus. She is right here. I want to pull you up on my taming in progress. Although, every time I've pulled this up while I'm recording, it always bugs out and it will show all my creatures. Thus, like I was saying, um, so let me re-click on it, so that way it auto-fixes, and then here we go. Now, I can look at you and see how you're doing. Okay, so you're doing fine. You're only starved down about 50. You are going to probably take quite a bit of time. So, what I am going to do is actually go look for a dodec now. Oh, uh, I messed it up. I messed it up. Duh. I yeah, I can't remember how to spell their names. Uh, I'll find it here. Dodecarus. There it is. Okay, guys. So we're over to the Dodec I chose here, and honestly, I'm I'm thinking we're gonna be good here. But as well, this yeah, this is the Redwoods. Things always go wrong in the Redwoods. Now 
before I start shooting, let's make sure I equip the narc tranks. And don't just start pelting him with arrows, thinking I'm tranquilizing him. Now, this is going to be pretty fun. Because this is on the side of the mountain, and I already used the trap to protect the Ankylosaurus. Even though I think the Dodec is probably going to be the one that needed it more. Actually, I think both of them would. Because these are both pretty sketch places. Because this could be easily, when I come back, or as of right now, like I could easily get attacked by a saber tooth or something. Luckily, though, I do have a high enough melee. Uh, I've been actually cranking that the last couple levels. Uh, so we are, I think after I put this next one in, we are going to actually be at 200% melee. Okay, we're coming up on a point here where, yep, my crossbow is going to break. So I, ooh, want to know something fun, guys? I did not bring my spare crossbow. So I'm actually just going to say this is an L on the dodec. Because I feel like we're not going to get back in time to actually do that. Oh, this is actually going to be bad. Because that was a lot of tranks I wasted into it. Alright. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to worry about the Anki for the rest of this episode. And getting the Mammoth raised up. So we're going to just say that the Dodak here was a loss. And we'll come back to this here. Because I can always use an Anki to help me gather stone as well. Even though it's going to technically give me more flint. But I could technically use an Anki. Even though that is a bit of a compromise. A Dodec is like that. It's like what I said with the Mammoth. The Dodec is the S plus stone getter. Just all around as of right now I believe. I think there might be some better ones on Scorched Earth. Um, I don't know what that creature would be though. I'm not hearing good things as I'm getting through the trees here. Oh dear, that there is three Carnos right next to my trap. Um, Mammoth is losing horribly. Oh, I gotta do something here. Cause this is how we lost an Argentavis in one of our attempts before I was, like I attempted recording my previous episode twice. One of them were ended horribly. And then the one, the second attempt where we actually managed to tame a decent level Argentavis. So, but yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of waiting to see what happens right now. Okay, those Carnos just won. And I'm betting they're high level ones, that's why they won. Level, oh yeah, no, we are not taking those out with a pike without me dying. But what we can do is fly low enough down to get their aggro. And just keep on flying until we get them a comfortable distance from the Ankylosaurus. Okay, looks like they are buggering off after a Parasaur. So I'm just going to yeet my way back here. Ooh, is that a... That's a baby saber tooth. That's two baby saber tooths. What is... If I can claim one of those, I could technically get me a meat gatherer. Come here, youngling. Oh, you have a mama somewhere. But why aren't you, like, right behind her? Oh, no, I can claim you. I can claim you guys. I'm betting, if anything, Mama Sabretooth got into a fight with one of the mammoths. Do I really want to keep one? Yeah. Yeah. Even though it's a low level, as of right now, I am kind of struggling to collect a decent supply of meat to keep on hand, especially cooked meat. So we are going to actually do that. But I do see it. There is a Carno right there. That is not comforting. So let me open the door here. Access you. And... You just eat as much of that as you want. I'm going to close this door back up. You're definitely not starved up enough here to finish. So what I'm going to do is get into the safety of my Pteranodon and hover. Now hovering does not expend... I got to lure it away. You're, you're too close for comfort. You're too close for my comfort. 
especially. Alrighty guys, and there we are. Our Anki is now fully tamed. So that means we are technically done for today. So I'm gonna head back to base. We're gonna go raise up the mammoth and the saber tooth. But for you guys, that is actually going to be it for this episode. So if you guys have found yourself at any point today enjoying this episode, please do consider leaving a like and subscribing. Also, remember to ring that notification bell and share this video. That does really help me out in the algorithm. So yeah, anyways, this has been Gunshot Moa, signing out. Peace. <laughs>